McKnight game. Former Islanders great Dennis Podvan, now a Florida broadcaster, watching with interest what's been happening with his former team. I asked him yesterday at the Meadowlands Arena if it bothered him and his ex-teammates that a Boston Bruin, Mike Milbury, was now running the Islanders franchise with the old Islander guard, most of it not even involved with the team. In a sense, yeah, you would think that maybe more uh, former Islanders would be involved, but I, I, I'm pretty convinced that the whole motto of the new, uh, the new operating group is that they want to distance themselves from the four cups. And maybe Why thinking, would you want to do that? Maybe thinking it's too much pressure on the, uh, the player today or something. So there was more of a considered effort to keep the, pan the Islanders out, the former Islanders, than there was to try and bring them back in, or, you know, instead of somebody new. So there was no doubt, boom, you know, Lauren Henning went, and right, right at that point there was a real effort, I think, to look outside the organization, and maybe the thought is to bring a new feel. I don't agree with it. The Islanders have been floundering. I mean, it's ridiculously. And they needed someone to say, all right, I'll take all the guilt, all the criticism, but I also want some of the credit. And I think Millbury's doing that. So slowly we're seeing that team start turning around, and maybe if they change their uniforms, they'll get respectability. But, uh, you know, you look at the... Uh, you don't like the new uniforms, no, huh? I tell you, it's unbelievable. More with Dennis Potvin later on in our half-hour show coming up at 10.30 tonight, right after the Rangers-Islanders game. And now we invite you to stay tuned. It should be by the score of 2-0. If you were with us in the pregame show, you heard Dennis Potvin's unhappiness with the way his former team, the New York Islanders, have been run in recent years. I asked if he were bitter about the Isles' fall from grace. No, you know what happens is that eh, it doesn't feel like my old alumni, that's all. And I think most of us kind of feel the same way. I, mean, I don't want to speak for everybody, but Bob Nyson is still in, very much involved with the organization. A lot of guys are still here in the New York area. It just doesn't feel, I don't watch the box scores for the Islanders. I should. I should be watching every night. What are they doing? What's going on? I don't. And why? They're not the old Islanders.